Well, this is weird. We are given a problem where it says J is the midpoint between points T and D. Point T is 1, 3, and point J is 4, 5. Now, 4, 5 is not an endpoint, but it's a midpoint. So I'm just going to come over here. I'm going to write MP right over there. Right, and we're given the other endpoint, which is 1, 3. So how are we going to do this? How are we going to solve for the other endpoint? We don't know what D is yet. So this is one of my favorite secret methods. All you are going to do is you're going to set up a problem where the endpoint goes on top, midpoint, endpoint. We know one of the endpoints. The endpoint uh, T is 1, 3. So I'm going to put 1, three right here and we know the midpoint which is four five so what we're going to do now is we're going to figure out what would we have to add or subtract to get from one to four the answer here is three you add three to get from one to four so I'm gonna write plus three and then I'm just going to do it again add three one more time that is the X value of our endpoint going from three to five what do you have to do what would you have to add or subtract? In this case, it is going to be two, and we are going to do it one more time. And our other value would be seven. So our end point here would be seven comma seven.